Hey everybody, it's Sarah from The Style Vlog. Thanks so much for tuning in. Today I want to do a video of how to save your messy, sweaty, gross workout hair without washing it. So go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you're not already subscribed. So I wanna tell you how much you guys, my loyal followers in this channel means to me. So I, it's 10 o'clock at night right now and I was like, I'm gonna film this video for them. I really wanna film this. And so I was like, I need to get really sweaty so I can actually like show you guys how to get rid of this hair. Like I'm not gonna just spray water on my hair and face and pretend like I was sweaty. So I ran down my street, our street is so long, and I did lunges until I couldn't feel my legs anymore and then I did squats until I couldn't stand anymore. So I'm a little wobbly, I'm very sweaty, but I had to like get the actual like sweat in my hair instead of just like spraying water on myself. So. <laughs> So it means so much to me for this channel to be super authentic and what you see is what you get. So I'm actually sweaty and let me show you how to quickly and easily save your sweaty gross hair. <laughs> So it's such a pain, especially with long hair, to wash it every time you work out, especially if you're working out every day, every other day. Like, I I don't, I can't sign up for that. That is too much work for me. So it's super important to me to be able to absorb all of the oil and sweat and grime and all that grossness without having to wash my hair every single time I work out. So basically, all you're going to need for this little tutorial is a hair dryer and some dry shampoo. I have two different kinds here. Um, I'm gonna, I have a brush handy and some hair powder but those are optional so first off let's take down this mess it's so disgusting Ugh. okay guys this is gross it's all wet oh can you see that Blech. this is so gross okay so we have our gross wet grimy oily hair and what I'm gonna do first is spray my dry shampoo so I'm using you guys if you've been around for a while, you know that I love this Living Proof dry shampoo. Um, my second favorite is this Batiste. It's much more affordable and works almost as well. So I'm going to take my dry shampoo and I'm basically just going to take my hair in sections and dry spray this on my roots. Okay, oh my gosh guys, look at my hair, it looks like a crazy mess. Okay, so I let the dry shampoo kind of soak in for about 30 seconds to a minute or so, and now I'm just gonna shake it out. Does anyone else wanna sing the Taylor Swift song every time you say shake it out? That's all I can think of. Okay, so really let's just get in there and shake, shake, shake all this dry shampoo around to absorb all of our oil. Okay, guys, I love this dry shampoo. It works so well. Okay, and now, so I feel like it's absorbing the oil, but my hair is still a little moist from all the sweat. So I'm gonna take my hair dryer, I'm gonna point it at the roots and just kind of blow dry it how I would blow dry it if I was just getting out of the shower from washing my hair. Okay, and then now I'm just gonna go back with a cool setting on the dryer, just going over the same spots. Okay, it's already looking much, much better. So let's try to find my part somewhere in here, somewhere in this madness. Ah, who knows? Okay, this looks pretty good, pretty close. Now my ends are crazy, so I'm just gonna brush through the ends here. looks pretty good you can still see the waves in my hair from before if you don't like that you can always go over it with a straightener if you feel like you need to um, my roots so they're not like wet and greasy and oily anymore but I feel like they're really flat so I'm just gonna take my big sexy hair powder play this is just like a texturizing powder and I'm gonna put this on my roots up top so I'm basically gonna do what I did with my dry shampoo with this powder I'm just gonna sprinkle a little bit in here I'm gonna rub this in. Whew, okay, that gave me some volume. Hello. Okay, whew. I feel like this looks 500% better than it did. Um, it no longer looks greasy. Like, can you tell that I was like super sweaty like five minutes ago? I can't. It doesn't look like my hair is sweaty or oily or green, gre greamy, greasy and grimy at the same time. Greamy, that'll be our new word. <laughs> All right, so my hair just has tons of body and volume and just, I don't, it's shiny and it looks like I just got a blowout of the salon and I just used a couple of products and a hair dryer and I'm good to go to work or the office or running errands, whatever I need to do. I don't look like 
I was a sweaty mess 10 minutes ago. And this doesn't just apply to working out. This can apply to, you know, if you're outside on a hot, sweaty day, if you're at an amusement park, at the beach, etc. Anytime you're hot and sweaty and you just want to look freshened up but you don't want to wash your hair, I always use these steps and it works for me. I hope it works for you as well. Okay, and then if your hair is just way too far gone, you can't fix it, you can't get anything to work, I always have this little top knot bun on standby. So you're just going to need a hair tie and you're going to pull all your hair to the top of your head. Okay, once it's on the top of your head, you're going to pull it around itself, but you're also going to twist at the same time. And then you're just going to wrap your hair tie around it. All right, and this is just my last ditch effort. If nothing else has worked, I gotta go somewhere and I don't have time to wash my hair, is this bun. Drop me a comment down below. Let me know what videos you'd like to see next. Thanks so much for tuning in and I'm looking forward to seeing you all next time. Bye.